everybody, it's Dylan Connor right here. Yep, welcome back to more Spirit Tracks. It's part two. So let's go up where we stopped before. And before, we didn't, we didn't talk to this thing, so we're gonna do it now. Talk to him. Yawn! That was a nice nap. 20 rupees. There's a treasure there. Let's go get it. I don't know where it went, so. Another battle, I know. It's outdoors. These things. Die. Ho, ho, ho. Ha, ha, ha. That's my cousin that was just going like boo, boo, boo there. Mm, die, boo. Maria, stop it or else you're being kicked out. That's my cousin hitting the stairs and my sister's saying that. Big hat. Ah. Die. Explode. Do I have a small key? No, I don't. Who is there? Nothing. I'll go up here then. Okay, floor three. Okay, that's easy. That's my sister talking. Whispering. Yeah, so that's what you're supposed to do. Is that the small key? Is that the small key? Is that the small key? We'll see. Now let's open that door, which is the door to the mini boss. Time for the mini boss. This box is actually kind of easy. All you need is blow that the spell back at him and hit him a lot of times. He just like, dead. And he exploded into 20 rupees. Go up the stairs. And now this part's the hardest part where you get the boss key. There's the boss door. And now Zelda tells you about that. You have to go over here. These guys, when you attack them, they turn to bombs. So then. Blow that puffy smoke. Blow more. Blow more. And there's another thingy here. Now what? Okay. 
Hey, can you be for me? Tell me where a chest is. There's one right beside me. Where is it? Oh, there's a button here. Yeah. That's how you do it. I got a Rudo crown. Okay, now let's press the button. Open that thing. That's my sister whispering. No. Yep, and I think we're going to end it off here now. So on part three, we're going to fight the boss. So bye-bye.